You know, we have so many new breweries popping up across our region, and it used to be that green beer was the only option available when it came to having a beverage on St. Patty's Day. But Stephanie Carson from the Thirsty Orange Beer Festival and Matt Green from Universal Wine and Spirits are here to show us some beer cocktail recipes that can make you the hit of your St. Patty's Day celebration. Thank you all for being here Thank today. You Thank so you so much. You know, not everybody wants a dark beer for St. Patty's right. Day. So or a green one. Or a green one, right. exactly. What's the green <laughs> stuff? So, um, and Matt with Universal Wine and Spirits, they're going to have a tent set up at Thirsty Orange. They're going to be doing beer cocktails. Ah. So this is just a sampling of what they're bringing to the and festival. And you're also having something at Universal tonight uh, for St. Patty's Day. Tell us about that. Yes, at our new location, it's called Universal Wine and Spirits Beverage Warehouse. It's okay. on 2815 West Market Street. We're having a Jameson tasting from 530 ah. to 730. So you can come and try three different types of Jameson and get your party started. And that's good Irish whiskey. Yes, sir. All right. Let's talk about these beer cocktails. Get us started. So, uh, well. <laughs> okay. Today we have Old Smokey's Blackberry Moonshine, and we have Catawba's Cream Ale that we're going with the beer cocktail. Mm -hmm. First, we want to dip it in the fudge. You got fudge right here. Yeah. Okay. And we're going to get that around the rim, and then we're going to go Oreo cookies. Yes, and berry Oreos. Berry so, Oreos. Yes. Okay. We're calling this cocktail the Neapolitan. <laughs> okay. So, and then, then we want to oh, do you got the moonshine. Got two moon. ounces of moonshine. And I smelled this earlier. This smells amazing. Yeah, and you know, so while Matt's doing this, I mean, this is just another example of how you can enjoy beer. So many people say, you know, I'm not crazy about beer or whatever, but there's different things that you can do with it. You can do something, you know, something like this where the flavors all kind of meld together, and this really tastes like Neapolitan ice cream. And you just right. want to top it off with the cream there you go. And Chris, if you want to try one, we've got one pre-made for oh, you. There. Me, okay, hang on. <laughs> Let me set this down. Okay, I don't want to get chocolate all over me, so. And you get the cookie in there, mm -hmm. and it leaves that sweet. Yeah. It definitely doesn't taste like beer. No. No, but it's another way to enjoy mm -hmm. it. And that's what it's all about. You know, they're going to be there at the festival teaching right. you different ways to enjoy it. They're also going to have the mixology bar there. Um, and, and, you know, we just really want you to experience it and experience all these local breweries that yeah. we have. And there's so many to choose from, and you're going to have a great selection there at Thirsty Orange. Yeah, we'll have about 150 different beers. Uh, it's also home to the Tennessee Championship of Beers. So a lot of these guys are bringing their best stuff because they're competing in that medal competition as well. And, and you say so you got the Jameson tasting tonight. Mm -hmm. So, But any you can handle any of their needs for St. Patty's Day or any day for, yes, as sir. far as their adult beverages. And so. at both of our locations this week, we have 15% off all Irish whiskey. So all right. save you a little, little money to come see little, us. A little savings there. Yeah. And tickets are still available. Tickets are available. Um, they're $45 for the grand tasting and $60 for the first pour, and it's April 9th, so you can get your tickets at thirstyorange.com. All right, let's take a look. Thank you all so much for being oh, here today. Thank, thank you for introducing it. me no, to no this. Problem. This is something completely different, yeah. and I like it. <laughs> <laughs> let's take a look at all the info. It's coming up. Thirsty Orange Brew Extravaganza, April 9th, 1 to 6 p.m. at Founders Park, and you can check out all the information at thirstyorange.com.